fellow Squeakers, and welcome back to another episode of Total War Warhammer, the Empire Campaign. So, in the last episode, uh, the last thing I realized just before I went off the, uh, off the channel was Chaos hasn't invaded yet. Uh, and it's 83. Uh, it's turn 83, so they're coming. They're, they're about to come. I'm actually a little surprised that they haven't come yet. And this, is, this has the potential to be bad. Because if they come south, and they, like, for example, head straight for, straight for Nordland over here, potentially I could fail this quest before I have a chance to do anything with them. So, I could potentially lose whatever it is that... I mean, I'm assuming it's the Reichland Rune Fang. Uh, that's the... You know, that's... I, I, I would have thought that it would have been Emperor Karl Franz's hammer. Um, but, in any case, I, I stand the possibility... There is a chance that I will lose this without ever... Getting a chance to do something about it. And... If that happens, uh, I'm going to be extremely disappointed with this game. Because for, for, for something so important to, uh, to, the, to this nation, uh, to, to the Empire leader, as his magic items, all the rest of, these, of, the, of the races I've played have never put this kind of barrier, uh, this kind of impassable barrier, that has that has been blocking me here. Uh, all of them have always like it's been closer to uh, closer along this line. It was go go off and, and beat people up or go to this place with a hero or whatever. It okay, I can do that. I mean it's it's a little annoying, but okay. But for for Nordland to just decide meh. We we don't we don't want to be helpful to you at all, and then lock it uh, lock the quest behind being friends with these guys. And despite the fact everything we've done, it's gone nowhere. I'm gonna be uh, this this is Empire is gonna quickly become uh, like is gonna hit the bottom of my list. But I mean just r basically right above chaos. <laughs> Although I understand Chaos has had a revamp, and I may, um, I may restart a Chaos campaign because it's recently been revamped, and uh, they've they've changed everything around now that they've added added Norska, um, and I kind of want to do Norska too because they got mammoths. <laughs> uh, I'm kind of tempted to to get the Norska uh, DLC and. Uh, try a Norska campaign. That that might be kind of fun too. But in any case, um, and, and if that's the case, the Empire is going to go straight to the bottom of my of my race of of, of my of my race preference. Um, and I would have thought that the Empire would be up there, considering it's like all artillery and tanks and you know lots of booms and crashes and yeah. Um, but so far, this campaign has been a trial. I mean, it's been less fun and more of a just a, a constant, unending Magnus. grind. Um, I don't know. It hasn't been fun. Um, it's been more of a slog than fun. And that's not how games should be. Uh, anyway, ever onward, ever onward Arch Lecter. Um, let's. Okay, Balthasar, how are you doing? Me. You're almost entirely healed. And when you get entirely he healed, I may hop over here and take her gig. It's the province capital, which means it'll be a walled city. It'll be another tough battle. This time, I will be wiser about using my artillery. 
Um, I, I, I think I, I have a better idea of how to properly utilize these guys in a siege battle. Uh, so I think next time I, I will do a better job. Um, so I may come over here and take her gig. Um, and, and, yeah, I, I, I may do that. By the comet. You are going to stay here for the time being. Castellan Engineer. Now, the engineers... Okay, um, I was thinking that the engineers might have uh, like some sort of uh, buff or bonus to to the tanks too, because you know they're engineers. You know, artillery tanks makes sense, but apparently they don't. So he's just going to continue to be um, to to be just a regular general. Uh, I'm not entirely sure I know what to what I want to do with him. Um, I think for now I'm not going to recruit any more units. I'm just going to keep what I have here and I'm just going to keep him planted where he is. Uh, let's look at our diplomacy. Auckland hates us. What a shock. Midland not really liking us much. But their main issue is that they just have a natural aversion and they don't like great power. And once we trespassed over into Middenland. We, we have the potential of increasing our relations with them as soon as we beat up on those Beastland. Um, and as long as we keep beating on Hawkland. And we keep trying to make friends with Nordland. So we'll, we'll, we'll see where that comes. Okay, can we? I will listen. Get but my time somewhere, is short. please. I'm tempted. That's a lot of money outlay, and I don't like that uh, uh, that kind of money outlay, though. Uh, Ostermark, you're continue. Yeah, you're 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 fine as is. Although, can we maybe get access? Approach and make your offer. Ah, that I ah, make no promises can. to my ascent. All right, let's see if we can't get some more money. Okay, we'll take that. Good. No more issues with Ostermark. Uh, going into their lands. Uh, Talabeklin, we still have all the access in the world. Um, Beastmen, we're about to, we're, we're about to make your life miserable. Uh, dwarves, okay, you're, you're improving. Interesting. The dwarves actually don't like the fact that we had treaties with Karak Norn? Your fellow dwarves? You don't say. Karakern are... We're still de uh, decreasing. <sighs> they don't like the fact that we're... Wait, hero actions against Karak uh, Hearn? When did we have hero actions against Karak Hearn? I don't remember us doing that. When did we do that? When have we ever acted against the dwarves? I don't remember. Oh well. I mean, I guess it's not important, but... Alright, so we don't really have anything politically speaking here either. Uh, Alright. Um... Let's just hit that turn again. Oh, 
Oh, the beastmen ran. Aha! No longer an issue. Thank you, dwarves. Talabekland. Oh, Talabekland is going to attack her gig. Okay, very good. Aha. Uh -huh. What is going on? Why are these guys able to hit uh, uh, to hit us so often? I mean, our chances of succeeding are garbage, and I've got anti-hero stuff. I swear the AI in this game. All right, Marienburg. We have an opening for you. We should probably put uh, put some walls on you. Um, I have been remiss in in doing this. Um, yeah, I'm thinking maybe. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe I have been remiss here. Uh, we, we need to put some walls on you. And, and we need to crank these things up. Um, and put some real defense on you. Uh, that's, that's, that's my bad. I, I will go ahead and take that hit. Um, where did they go? Where did those stupid beastmen go? Make haste, men! Oh! <laughs> oh, really? You don't say. That's where you win, huh? Bring me to my men. And there you are. You ran for it. I'm finishing you. And I will fight with you. Say goodnight, Gracie. Move. Beastmen have been obliterated. Ooh, and a sword of striking. Ooh. I command here. Ooh, and I just gained a point. Nice. Okay, um. Uh, Emperor's Journey. Yeah, weapon, t uh, weapon strength and an unbreakable. Yeah, Emperor's Journey. That's that's too good to to, to overlook. All right. Uh, so we already have the brass cleaver on you. Who needs a sword of striking? I think Balthazar needs a sword of striking. Yeah. Um, high seas attrition. I don't really see that as being a, a, a an issue. Why not? Let's give it to you. <laughs> because reasons. Uh, okay. Um, Nome. Nome. Okay, you have three more turns uh, before you do your thing. So what can we do in the meantime? We do have... Oh, there we go. Okay, uh, exorcism. 
Oh, uh, okay, so it's negative four leadership against the undead. You know, I should probably put him in the protection force against the undead, one would think. He would, you know, just a, he would think. Light of ballet, uh, battle unbreakable. It's too bad that's only for 25 seconds, because that's really not that useful, but... This net of am am talk That is very useful. Then again, this would be uh, useful if I, I noticed, oh no, I've got a group breaking. I could throw I could I could throw this spell on them and at least make it so they don't break. So I guess that's not a bad. That's not, I guess that's not useless. Let's go ahead and throw Fa's protection on them though. All right, so is it time? Carl, you've done your thing. You know what? We're gonna uh, we're gonna My come back to, move. to to Marienburg for a little bit, and we're gonna allow your influence to 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 reduce corruption out here and we're also uh, uh, we're also going to prepare for the inevitable invasion uh chaos is coming ready to serve a and i think we need to start recognizing the fact that chaos is coming and we need to do something about it um warrior of sigma What are we going to do with you? I mean, I mean, I know what we're going to do with you, because we're going to go over here to work bad, and I guess My journey begins. this will also put you in a decent place for coming up here to reinforce. Hmm. Now. Now. <laughs> yes, now. <laughs> Oh, yeah, this is going to be a walk in the park. Her gig will fall, and fall hard. So, we're going to no we're gonna do this right war. now. Um, really, they, they, think that, uh, they think they've got a chance, huh? It doesn't look like they've got much of a chance to me. But, okay. We'll go ahead and fight this battle. <clears throat> it'll be it'll be interesting. It'll be fun. We'll do things. We'll meet friends. We'll influence people. <sighs> because this time we will be wiser about our uh, about our artillery. See, I forgot my lesson that I learned with the dwarves. You place your artillery. You leave it alone. Oh, definitely going to risk for more favorable wins. A five? I got to do better than a five. Not much better than a five, but I'll take it. All right. So, all... Okay, so we only have... Uh, I mean, we're all along here. So, we have real Let possibility here. Yeah. Say, so, okay, we're going to... You know what we're going to do? We're gonna go. Eh. We are Sigmar's heirs. We're gonna group. We're going to attack this main. Yeah. See, this will give us coverage across pretty much the entire battlefield, uh, and this will get us all the way. Yeah, this will get us all the way to the back. So we're literally just going to sit right here. Um, our initial attack will be against the gate, but after that gate falls, we're not going to have any target whatsoever, and we're just going to let them fight. Let them fight! Alright, uh, right, you guys. Our weapons are yours. Well, yes, your weapons are mine, because they're, they're mine. I, and I, I want them, so they're mine. All right. Spot us the target. Put them there. 
and you guys are going to be my my follow-up force so as a matter of fact you know what we're gonna put you over here so that when we break down the gatehouse we will hmm am I doing this wrong they definitely have more towers over here if I hit this side it's much less defended <clears throat> Uh, I bid two clubs, and yes, I may, I know I've made that uh, that joke several times, and it just keeps getting funnier every time I say it. <laughs> I'm actually just tempted to keep them right where they are because they still have full range on pretty much the entire battlefield and that's the point um, I want I'm just gonna let them fire at whatever target they want to fire at all right and start battle and pause you guys Start firing on them. That's going to be your only target. The only, I mean, afterwards I may have you fire on them just because. Maybe I'll have you start firing on towers. I don't know, but right now that's your target. You are also going to come up here and start beating on that. You guys are going to start marching forward and... I didn't realize it was such a it was such a thing. That's oh, all right. Um, and then you guys are going. Let's see how far can you do. So we're going to have you march up to no to here, and you can start firing on whoever you like. <laughs> And go. Right, Scott Knights. There we go. Blast that gate open, guys. Oh, are you serious? Well, that was poorly done. That was badly positioned. <laughs> guys start shooting start shooting them Alright, you guys, hit these walls, hit them hard, 
be you guys charge in and exploit and, and exploit you charge in, charge in and exploit to reposition you guys out like this March as one. we're just gonna reposition you guys so that you're not being blocked by trees anymore Target too close. Okay, um, then, well, shoot. Actually, there's there's, there's no good targets here. Uh, <laughs> All right, we won't mess with that then. All right, hit him. Get in there, guys. Come on. Rush in. Balthazar is holding that line by himself. He's about to get uh, hes about to get smacked. For some reason, apparently, he's not a, ba a, a, a fighter whatsoever. Okay, so, Balthazar, you need to get out of there. Oh, wait. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Get in here. No, no, no. Get back. You. Oh, I can't do anything with him. Okay, so he's, he's just running. So, okay. That's fine. You can just run. All right, you guys are launching. You're doing exactly what you're supposed to be doing, and that's fine. My guys are taking some pretty heavy-duty casualties here. We are... We are going to pile our guys in. Okay, you you keep recovering, dude. You're gonna. I'm gonna have you come over here. You're, you're just going to provide leadership bonuses. That's that's your job right now. And you're going to plague of rust these guys. And you're going to wreck their faces too. Oh, I just hit my own guys. <laughs> well, shiitake mushrooms. <laughs> Why are you Ulrich's teeth retreating? All right, so you're in here. Take them all. Can I can I do anything with you, or can I just maybe bring you over here? Moving. Let's just bring you over there and take that place, or I can just win. Well, not probably not my best finest hour, but that went a lot better than the last time where I was having my artillery charge the walls. <laughs> that was just I don't know what happened with those artillery man of course and this these artillery weren't exactly smart I mean they were like firing at the, like the center of the town where there was nobody so I don't, I don't know what was going on there 
All right, so we will. Oh. Oh, how tempting is that? Oh, that's a lot of money. We're sacking it. Onwards. Oh, and another, and another sort of swift sling, which is so very nice. No peace. Go Just back in war. and occupy. As you say, sir. And yes, her gig's gonna have some some issues for a little while. Her gig can have some issues for a little while. That's okay. Uh, we're gonna repair, 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 because that's money. That's a thing, and that's okay. You know what? This is this is okay. This is a this is an okay thing. All right. I am the supreme patriarch. Well, you're not the Supreme Patriarch yet, but I do intend to make you that Supreme Patriarch. Um, glittering robe? Yes. I, I think we can, we can glittering robe you. Oh, I just did the heal. I, I, I was going to say, wait a minute, that's less money than I expected. That's because I just did the repairs. That's why. Okay. All right, all of our forces, except yes. for you, have not done yet. Um, what I am thinking of doing is having... Carl and Elgar over here get together, swap some units, and then send Carl over here to Nuln. And that way I've got, uh, I'll give Elgar the uh, extra units that I don't want Carl to necessarily have, and it'll make room in Nuln. Alright, it'll, it'll make room for him here to add the steam tanks and the and the other stuff that I want to add there. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, that's right. I can hire a witch hunter here. Ew. No, not drunk, just legless. <laughs> or I can make him stupid. <laughs> oh, and he's got... Oh, it's the witch hunters that are able to block armies. You don't say. Oh, and I can... Oh, and I can hire warrior priests here. That's right. And I can hire another Empire Captain. Oh, you know, this has the potential to... Hmm. This has the potential for something big here. Um, I could create a hero army. Uh, much like I did with uh, the vampire counts. Probably won't be as, as awesome as the vampire counts. But I'm willing to bet it would be very effective. Alright, let's do a witch hunter. The nation calls. Let's do this warrior priest, since apparently we can only do one. What do you require? Let's do the last Empire Captain. The Empire! And then let's... Wait a minute, shouldn't he... Hold on. 
We're in Altdorf. Shouldn't I be able to... Oh, Carl isn't isn't here. That's why nobody's able... Uh, nobody's getting their bonus levels. Oh, ugh, come on, lion. Ugh. Interesting. <laughs> Didn't realize warrior priests were like that. Okay, um... I am tempted to go the blue route for warrior priests. Especially since um, I intend to make a hero army. Having the ability to like heal own army um, and, and have some of this reduction in corruption and all that. I mean, all this is, is obviously very good. And definitely I'm think, uh, I want to take these. Maybe I'll just... Man, tough choice. Um, no, I think I'm gonna go go ahead and go the yellow route. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna go yellow route for the time being. Um, let's just make sure there's no one else to, okay, no one else to, to raise up. Darn it, I forgot that I have to have Carl be the one in town doing all of this. I thought he was empire-wide, that he would be able to, uh, that, that they would all get their bump in the, in the, uh. <sighs> All right, no biggie, no biggie. It's fine. It's fine. To the it's fine. Sigmar heals us. Sigmar does heal us, uh, but only. Is it time? Keen sight. But but only because Sigmar. How should we proceed? Is is like well... a really cool guy, and he he gives ice cream uh, so? to to people, and you know Sigmar's cool like that. All right, Altdorf, the Conclave, oh, that's right, the Altdorf Colleges of Magic would give us the Luminarch. Look at that damage. Missile damage 550, armor piercing 950, explosive base 300, explosive armor piercing 700. Total of 1208 all told, and that's just kind of how it's divided up on what does what. I mean, this thing's a beast. Your average, your, your average lord is 450, and they are like warrior, like just monsters. Being able to just point this at a dude and blast them. I mean, obviously in melee, in melee they stink, but who cares? They're they're not intended. They're, they're not intended to get into melee. Their job is to stay back and fire from a distance. That's just. That's just wow. Small area of effect, which means that's that's awesome against single targets. Oh man, that's tempting. But that's thirteen hundred and fifty. If 
I click this... Now, you know what? We got to do Nuln. Nuln has to take priority. Nuln is our... Oh, but right now, Nuln has nothing to... Has nothing to buy. Of course, it will. In three turns, it's going to have a lot to buy. In three turns, I'm going to have 1,100 and 10,000. So, I mean, that's, that's 2,100 right there. Plus... Plus whatever I'm going to have for the next one, which I'm not entirely sure I know what to do for number five. Maybe I'll just... Well, no, growth would be pointless at that point, because it'll be... I won't have any need for growth anymore. Maybe just tap room? That seems wasteful, too. Maybe I'll do a shrine. Yeah, maybe I'll do, maybe I'll do, oh, you know what? That may not be a bad idea. Maybe I'll do the shrine, and that'll give me, oh, wait, no. No, I should do a wizard conclave. That way I can, I can do the Luminarch. You know what? I think that's the, because that way it'll be, this will be strictly, this will be all, all artillery all the time. You know what? I think that maybe that's the best way to go. Um, and, but this is. I mean, this is a ton of money, too. So, save your money. Save, save our money. We're, we're, we're gonna... We, we have to think long-term here. Long-term. Although, this may not be a bad idea, either. Ugh, we have so much to buy. Long-term. Long-term, Lion. We we have we've been playing the underdog this entire time because you're not thinking long term. Nordland, Surely buddy, will be reached, pal, but are we not friend. <gasps> no kidding. They're already going to be making out like a bandit. We're not going to make hardly anything off of them. But this has the potential for big diplomatic bonuses. Gold is owed. The choice of payment is yours. We take Imperial Crowns as preference. You know what? Nordland, I would do this for no one else but you. And that's only because I want that stupid magic item. As far as I'm concerned... Your fodder, otherwise. But that just made a big, big difference. All right. Talabeckland. Continue your fight against Hawkland. Still doing well against dwarves. Or, not against dwarves, with dwarves. <sighs> Alright. The rest of this is... The rest of this is a thing, and uh, there's not much we go, uh, else we can do at this point. So we're going to... Oh, I have damaged buildings. I have damaged buildings. I... Um, I mean, I do want to have at least some, uh, the ability to recruit some, some forces here, so I don't think this is a bad idea. Um... Because there may come a time when 
I need to... I mean, chaos comes and I need to raise a quick army. So, that may not be a bad place. And let's see, Talibime, uh, uh, Talibime do we have a... I mean, hunting, hunting camp. We'll want to do hunting camp. But otherwise, you don't have anything special. I don't think I necessarily... Of course, I just spent the money to, uh, to, to fix those, didn't I? <laughs> I'm such a short-sighted fool sometimes. Um, I think it would be wise to remove the stables and add the basic walls. Um, I think that would be a good idea. Um, Alright, but other than that... Let's hit the turn. Oh, mighty lord. The fates have surely selected you for greatness. Thank you. Shut up now. Oh. Grave news, my lord. Word is there spreading across are. the land of a dark power rising in the northern wastes. The armies of chaos are on the move. They surely plan to invade the world of mortals once again. Prepare your defenses well, for the forces of chaos spare no one in their quest for bloodshed. Dire tidings from the north. All right. Fine. That's fine. Under the Dark Moon's glare, your warriors range deep into hostile lands, but all is not well. There are dark omens. Um. You know what? I'm 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 okay with spending fifteen hundred for for war fervor. Wow, we got a big chunk of change there. All right. Um, what? You are going to need to sit there and heal for a while. Uh, that's that is fine. Cool. Carl. 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 Chaos is coming. Norska isn't. But Chaos is. Carl, I think it is time for you to start making your way back to... Talibim. Um And Carolberg, you guys are going to have to suck it up and, and deal with the fact that I'm passing through your lands. Um, Mid Mid Midland is just going to have to deal with that because... Chaos is coming, and I need to go to the defense of our allies. True servant of Sigma. I am also thinking that maybe I need to... Instead of sending you to work bad, I'm thinking I need to send you to Castle Von Rocken. Because chaos is on the way. And that's Wintertooth. That's not technically chaos, but I'm going to want. Really? Are you just going to sit there this whole time? I don't. Grave can, new. Can, repair your defenses you well. Go away. How do I shut you up? I don't remember. Spare Advisor, no one. go away. Um, I want to be in place to come and defend Norden if I need to. Uh, uh, for Nordland, we're not going to go all... Do not waste my potential. I won't. Uh, I am not going to go through Sigma. all this just for Nordland to get buried under a tide of chaos. It's not happening. I, I refuse. Uh, Elgar, we march. I'm going to move you down here to Nuln, and I'm going to have you ready to take on a bunch of... Artillery. Yes, General.
Why did you guys not join this army? I could have sworn I told you guys to join that army. I could have sworn I said that. Hmm. Okay. Death training. It is time. Looking ahead. Yes, son of Sigma. Let us move. Uh, no. What do you require? I require you to get in this stupid yeah. army. So? I will marshal the men. Moving off. All right. <sighs> Balthazar, you're going to stay where you are. Okay, so everybody else has moved. We've got a lot of money. I know I need to spend a lot of money in Gnome. In two turns, we're going to do some big-time upgrading. But can I do anything? Is anything necessary right now? Averheim, Averheim, and Grenzalt? Not really. Altdorf? Uh, it's really tempting. It's really tempting. Um, we're bad upgrading your walls. Again, really tempting. Uh, upgrading your defenses. Again, really tempting. Uh, Moot? If we were to upgrade you, what would we upgrade you with? I think we would probably add... Probably a sh Well, we've got a shrine right now that's reducing corruption in our lands. If I added another shrine... It would almost be overkill. Maybe tap room in order to ensure our public order continues to be strong. Of course, that's actually fine. Um, I'll hold off for now. Um, if I don't know for sure, I'm not going to waste it. Uh, oh, Marienburg. Uh, oh, shoot. In 11 turns, you're also going to need to be buffed, uh, uh, pumped up to level 5 so that we can get your your stuff cranked up because that's more money and as soon as we've got you to level five I'm I'm gonna raz you and turn you into something else with money hmm. all right um, and of course Wissenlin with Nome. Uh yeah right now you're you're not you are not a priority. Uh, Hawkland. Oh, that's right. Brass Keep. You're the other one over here. Um, but maybe for right now, we're not going to mess with... Oh, wait. That's Nordland right there. Huh. Okay, good for you, Nordland. Yeah, we're just gonna send our guy over there and prepare for 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 the attack. Talibheim, we or Tal Okay, so Talibekland, what were we doing? Yes, we were gonna do a hunting camp with you because we could add that to our trade, and trade is good. Uh, otherwise... Otherwise, I think that's really all we can do for now. Two more turns, we'll have a new technology. <coughs> do we have any more diplomacy we can do right now? Oh, they're starting to... 
Approach us, friend, and oh, make your offer. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Ugh. Okay, give it. It's all right. It's all right. Give it another couple turns. It's it's increasing, and it's increasing in leaps and bounds. So that's good. Ooh, war with warriors of chaos. That's good. If I can get some solid actions against, uh, against the the chaos, maybe uh, that'll probably improve even further. So if that comes to pass, that would be nice. Middenland, oh, you're improving too. Even though I've been trespassing in your area. Okay, uh, I'm not going to complain. Good grief, all of our relations suddenly went up big time. <gasps> chaos. Now that chaos has come, everyone's going, Oh dear, I'm afraid, I'm afraid, I'm afraid. And now, ev oh, this is our chance to be super political. Oh, yeah, and Bretonia, and oh, ho, 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 ho. You don't, oh, but not Carrot Cadron. No, 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 not you guys. No, you guys, you, you guys don't care. <laughs> Freaking dwarves. You don't even care that we're fighting the war against chaos. Freaking dwarves. All right, Kislev, are, are you at any time ever gonna be like and and border really border princes? You, you guys are. Uh, I tell you, I tell you. But this is our chance. With the war against chaos coming, we have the chance to be able to like unite <coughs> the empire. To unite the empire as it has never been united before. <laughs> uh, I should get another. I really should get another lord just so I can put him as treasurer and put Balthazar over as spy master. Not yet. Uh, let's hit that turn one more time. And then I think we may call this an episode depending on what happens here. Who are you? Okay, you can fail. I don't mind. The Brass Sentinel speaks. The Death Knell Watchtowers acts as a warning for the Empire. The Brass Sentinel atop each one whirls into action, reciting a message to the next Watchtower in the chain using the Semaph... Glorious. However, they have been known to send false signals on many occasions. So if I heed the warning, then campaign movement... Wait. If I heed the warning, we get a negative 25 to campaign movement for the next 25? Or the next 10 turns? Or it's a waste of time and we get chaos corruption. Seriously? So if we heed the if we if we listen to the warning, somehow we get hindered and if we ignore the warning, we get chaos. You guys are hurting my feelings. Well, we can't get chaos. Chaos will really wreck us. Oh, ten turns of negative campaign. That's just... Man. You hurt my soul. You hurt my soul! Alright, Carl. Um...
keep making your way towards this area. We are going. We're, we're not waiting around for chaos. We're we're. Praise be to Sigma. We're we're probably going to end up taking the fight to them. Alright, these guys are still recovering. That's fine. You sit there and recover. You make your way to Nuln and as long... Oh. Really? All of a sudden we have Chaos Corruption. Why do we have Chaos Corruption? We have Chaos Corruption all over the place. But why? We don't have any Chaos here. Oh, because of Chaos Rises. Okay, who are you? Where did you come from? And who said you could be messing with my people? And why do I have to kick your butt? Huh? Why do I gotta do it? Why are you forcing my hand? <laughs> Alright. You're forcing my hand. No. Yes. To the provinces. We're not messing around with you. I don't know what you're doing here, but you ain't sticking around. We are going to put you in your place. All right. Balthazar, okay, you're the nation called. You're you're fine where you are. No. Next turn next turn so still we're not going to spend a, we're not going to spend anything unless something is just absolutely vital none of these things are vital uh man but we we're definitely i i'm thinking we're going to do these next after we complete null i think that's the next thing we're going to do uh if I see Chaos making a beeline for here, I will definitely crank up the, the walls here, but I, I am going to anticipate that we are going to be able to stop them here. We are still waiting on Marienburg to crank up one level, uh, one more level of growth. Um, Wissenland. Yeah, you're still doing your thing. Castle Von Rocken. Otherwise known as a prime target. We're we're okay for public order. I sure would like to get a shrine going here. I sure would like that. But I really don't have any space for it. Well, we're just going to have to tough that out. All right. Uh, other than that, I think we've gone through and. Oh, you know what? I, uh, I mean, it's not urgent, but we can we can spend a thousand to 
to crank up our, our fur production. Don't you think? I mean, additional growth for... You know what? That, that's... That's, that's, that's reasonable. A thousand is reasonable. All right. <clears throat> One more turn and uh, we'll get the technology going, which means the next turn is going to be really, really big. Um, Nordland? Welcome, my countrymen. Nordland? Not yet. All right. Oh, wait. I think we already did this, didn't we? <laughs> did we? Did we already do this? I think we already did this this turn. Um, in any case. Uh, all right, guys. I think that's going to do it for this particular episode. In the next episode, we will definitely have a uh, a lot going on. The next turn is is going to be big. We're going to have a, a big Nuln, uh, a big Nuln boost. Uh, we're going to have uh, the, a new technology. Uh, that, Lots of stuff is going to be happening, so stay tuned for the next episode. It's going to be exciting. Uh, but that's going to do it for this particular episode, everybody. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. It helps me out so very much. For those of you who are regular viewers of mine, please make sure you're hitting that subscribe button and sharing my videos on your social media. I truly appreciate it when you do. And for those of you who already support me in all the ways that you do, thank you. You guys are fan freaking tastic. I am. I am hoping that you're. Hmm. What's going on here? Well, I am hoping that uh, my my entertainment value is worthy of your time, and the fact that you guys stick around and watch me uh, is is encouraging me and letting me know. Uh, so. Uh, please leave comments and let me know if you like what you're seeing and if you want me to do anything particular if you got any suggestions hey i'm i'm down with anything you got to say as long as it's positive you know don't 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 be don't be negative <laughs> and as always everyone always remember that anyone can be a mouse that roars but it takes someone special to be a lion that squeaks so embrace your inner lion and squeak on <laughs>